Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Hello, everyone. Happy New Year. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, everyone. Happy Wednesday. And welcome to tonight's Tiger Sports live stream network broadcast of the second round of the Iowa High School Athletic Association playoffs. There's a dome spot on the line tonight as the visiting Grinnell Tigers take on the top-seeded Xavier Saints. It's the first round of the 2020 Iowa High School Athletic Association football playoffs. To tonight's Tiger Sports live stream network postseason broadcast. We're in the round of 32, and tonight's game brings us to Grinnell between the 6-2 Grinnell Tigers and the 7-1 Fort Madison Bloodhounds. Hello, everyone. I'm Blake Walker, along with my partner Dan Walker. Craig Seeks running our camera. Blitz coming. McGriff picks it up. Wyatt gets the carry. A burst. Here comes Wyatt Hunter with a lane to go. Wyatt Hunter. Goodbye. Touchdown, Grinnell. Picked up by... Stewart, Daisy, who spikes it back over the cross. How about the play by nice Kaylin Kriegel and McKenna Smith to go in there and get the point. Kate lines it deep. Center field, it is gone. Kinkle down low on the floor. Leah Harris fires a three. To the lead goes Grinnell. Coming into four, those, yeah. those mental mistakes should be taken care of by now. Wyatt gets a block up in front of him. He cuts to the left, makes a man miss, and walks in standing up. Touchdown, Grinnell. He sneaks away. Van Copernol to the corner. Lauren Pease lets go for three and knocks it down. Owen Kaufman lines it into the gap. It gets past the second baseman. Strovers over the top. Good play as it was on the floor. Good job by Indianola to get it right back across. Imhoff will set up back for Lauren Bolte and a heck of a spike. They're going to say it was touched. Point goes to Grinnell. She does, lays it down. It comes loose, Hannah Barons comes home. Everybody's safe and it's a tied game. For the Bloodhounds, high snap. Williams has to pick it up. He's gonna fire over the middle of the field. It's gonna be intercepted. Picked off, A.J. Wilkins. Makes a couple man miss and down he goes. Can they keep number three Dallas Center Grimes on the ropes? A.J. Wilkins knocks down another Polly Eyes three-pointer. Grinnell's jumping out to an 8-2 lead. Bolte to Imhoff, Imhoff to Daisy Harris in for the point. Drew Hillman, the senior, against Will Doty, the sophomore. Swung on and missed, strike three, and Will Doty saves the ball game and Grinnell wins. Dylan brought up in the front court. Here's A.J. Wilkins to the basket, goes right down low to Aaron Campbell. Nice play by Grinnell. Hoffman in motion again. This time McGriff will throw. Nobody's open, but the right side of the field is. McGriff makes two guys break an ankle, and he walks in for a touchdown. And here comes a press by Indianola. No one's getting up for Grinnell. Here's a deep pass to Owen Coffin. He will dunk it on the other end. Mattis, step back, his floater, no good. Coley puts it up, he misses, and Grinnell wins. Intercepted by Van Kopernal. She'll push up to Ivy. Ivy coast to coast off the glass, and it goes. Who gets wide open? Latimer for three, and it goes. Yeah, you got it right network. here. You got it. Yep, 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 yep. Williams yep, yep. lines that one right into on the, the base, gap. On the base, on the base. And everybody's safe. Timeout on the court, 16-1. Grinnell trails. Memmer to the basket. He's got it for two, and Grinnell wants a timeout. 17-14. Grinnell on top. Grinnell's got to get it across, they do. That was a great play by Lauren Bolte, but an even better play by Turner as she knocked it back across, just trying to save the ball. Third and three for the Tigers. McGriff keeps it, McGriff with a the hole. There goes Cole McGriff to the right side, a burst, foot race. And Cole McGriff will win it every single day. Touchdown, Grinnell. Rexeroff reaches, and we are tied. McGriff outside, Mateus to the wing, down low to Jake Cole. his pull-up jumper is good! The Iowa Girls High School Athletic Union reminds you to practice good sportsmanship at all times, support your athlete and team positively, and enjoy the game. The Iowa Girls High School Athletic Union thanks you for your support of your local team and student athletes. Hard to guard, that's for sure. Meredith McKnight for the long, Polly Eyes 3 partner. Swung on and missed, and in a muggy July night at Fowler Field, the 10th ranked team in 3A has fallen. Grinnell defeats Ballard 4 to nothing. Grinnell is a playoff team. The Tigers are going to the third round. Welcome to the Sweet 16. They defeat Fort Madison 35 to nothing. With the cherry on top, and the Xavier Saints are marching back to the Unidome. The Iowa Girls High School Athletic Union is proud to champion the Iowan girl. 
Thank you for joining us to support young women in athletics and ensuring that they continue to walk down every main street in every town with their head held just as high as every boy. And that will do it. Grinnell is moving on to the second round in their bracket. But that will do it for us. Thanks for watching the Tiger Sports Live Stream Network. I'm Blake Walker, Dan Walker, Craig Seeks running our camera. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for watching. Enjoy your week. Stay safe and go Tigers. Go Tigers. And go Tigers.